Hi all, it's Angela. I am going to do a three ring pour. So I'm gonna bring you down so you can watch. And I hope everyone is doing well. Thank you to my subscribers, all my likes, uh, my resin people, the epoxy resin store, for all their beautiful resin and all the beautiful stuff I get out of the resin. And Rick Scheidel for his paint, Christina, Wolf for her paint, uh, just for you online <clears throat> uh, for the glitter. Laura's Art Corner for their glitter, their paste, just resin for your beautiful paste as well. I use everyone's stuff. I don't stick to one kind because there's certain things I like in one store that I like in the other store. And I'm not going to pick and choose just one or two stores. That's not the way I go. So I hope you all could appreciate that all my work is done with just about everybody's uh, products. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to do a three ring pour with... Or it's going to be a wreck, the re ring pull. So I'm trying this for the first time. So let's see how it goes. Okay, guys? Here we go. And I still got some of Rick's colors in here. And some new colors that I got because uh, my husband uh, got me new paint. He didn't know that I was using any particular paint from anyone online. So he just, when my husband goes to the art store and he picks up stuff, he just picks up things for me. He doesn't think, oh, you know, she's using Rick's or Christina's paint. He just picks up stuff. He doesn't know about all this goody stuff that we do for each other and how we, how we refer, you know, our products here on YouTube. So he doesn't know any of that. He doesn't even care about any of that. He just cares that if he goes to the store and like he went to Blix the other day and uh, he picked me up some canvas. And that's how he got some paints that I got now also. Cause he just goes and gets whatever he finds. Mm. The only thing I use the same as my resin is always going to be from the Epoxy Resin Store because I do like their resin. Okay, so everybody to each his own, you know. You got to like what you do. And it's funny that I got some cells in here because I didn't put any, any kind of silicone, so... Um, I imagine that it's coming from the paints that I got from other people, uh, from Rick's paint or I know where. And definitely, I didn't add any silicone. But uh, there you go. It's all done. Oh, this one's supposed to be a little bit more burgundy because it is burgundy. So, you know me, I always do this just to make sure I get that eye look in there beautiful. And uh, <clears throat> I'm doing the same thing with this one, too. Mm -hmm. And then what you do with, they call it a three-ring pour with a wreck, is they uh, put a little spin in it by doing this to it, doing this to it, doing this to it, and doing this to it. And then just mixing it. Yep, just twirl it around. That's what I'm doing. Here we go. Let's see how it turns out. And some of it's falling off the canvas. Uh, mm -hmm. This is a canvas I found upstairs in one of my rooms of an old painting. I didn't like the way it looked, so I painted the canvas all white last night the background and decided I'm going to use it today until I get my own new canvases that my husband ordered from a Blick store. So, boy, am I going to have cells in this one. Looks like I have plenty of cells in this one. 
Look at that. That's really a wreck. Like they say, it's a wreck. A wreck guitar. That's really a wreck. And these are really cells down here. I can't believe it. I thought it was the canvas. It's not. Those are real cells. Okay. So I'm very happy with this. And I'm um, going to give it a little torch right now. <clears throat> I don't know. I just want to kind of cover this side. I don't like the way this looks. I just, just the way I am. Fuddy duddy. That's the way I am. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm gonna hit it up with the blowtorch. Hit it up everywhere. Just trying to cover the edges because they don't seem to be fully covered. So I'm gonna take paint from down here and throw it right on it. And uh, bit of that paint in there and then let you guys go this paint comes ready to pour so that's the good thing about rick's paint that they're just ready to pour and that's it yeah you could get these in uh counter culture diy rick's titles paint <clears throat> and that's it i don't have too much of his paint anymore i'm almost done with it uh All right, I'm gonna give you a close up. I'm not gonna do the blow gun because to me it's just a waste of time. It's too much burning the, the paint, burning your canvas. Yeah, you don't need all that burning up of. This corner looks fabulous. I love it. So beautiful. Yeah. So much cell in this paint. I don't know. I don't know, Rick. So much cells. Somehow it always looks better the next day. So that's it, guys. Love you all. Bye-bye.